What's up guys, Nugget Eden Lawn Services. Working in the shop today. The old Time Master needs a little maintenance. The belt that comes off the crankshaft comes over to power the blades. The V-belt is almost ready to break. So we have a new one over here on the bench. Let's get this thing tore apart and uh, get her fixed up. So this is a little guard that goes around the belt itself. And you really don't need to take that off completely. You can just uh, loosen it up and I'll show you what I mean. Oh, I don't have the right socket. Yeah, I do. So what you can do is you can just take it off, you just loosen up one side, and then you can just flip it out of the way. See, and then you're not having to remove it completely. But this is the V-belt right here that we need to replace. It is toast. It is really bad shape. So now we need to do everything else from underneath, so we gotta flip it over, okay? I don't know if you can see it underneath here, but it's this belt right here. And it's hard to see because the lighting back here sucks, but we're gonna have to remove this belt in order to get this one off anyways. And this is just the belt to the transmission, and it's really easy to deal with. Um, it's, it's simple. So let me get the right tools here. All right, so the spring right here, we need to get that removed. So I grabbed a pair of Ice grip, see if I can clamp onto it. This little bracket, you can kind of just go like that. And we're just going to let that there it is right there. See, there's the spring. Take that out, and then the transmission you can just rotate and it gets out of the way. And then see that we've got this belt. There we go. So we got the transmission belt out of the way. All right. Transmission belt actually is in pretty good shape. I replaced this a couple years ago, so it's good to go. But this is the belt in question. There, I just went and got a deep socket, a deep well. So let's see if we can reach it through this hole right here. Yeah, see, that's better. Now we're talking. Can I make it any long-winded or more long-winded? Wow. There we go. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so we pulled the bolt out, guys, and then this, this bracket right back here, I don't know if you can see it, which kind of holds the belt on. We can kind of bend it up out of the way a little bit. And now, I think, I can get the belt off if we hold our tongue just right. Oh, it's just a tight fit right there. There we go, got it. All right, so there's the belt in question. Look at that thing, holy cow. Told you she was about ready to break in two. Look at that. All right, so let's get the new one. Here's the brand new belt. It's all stiff, it's gonna be hard to work with and get it underneath there. We will figure it out. All right, now we need to get back around this pulley. Push the pin, but I gotta turn it. There we go, got it. Okay, and then we need to get it underneath that bracket. Yeah, okay. Get it forward. Come on, baby, don't fight me now. Oh.
Okay, got it up in there. Let's get it on that pulley. And we'll put this bolt and bracket back in, which is right here. Tighten that bad boy back down. Guys, I wish I could sh have better lighting to show you all this, but I think you get the idea. It's just so hard to see underneath there. like new all right where's my spring gotta put my spring back on so we'll get it clamped back up Ugh, there we go get down in there hook it onto there uh oh wait we gotta put the belt on shoot don't forget the belt guys we gotta put this belt the drive belt for the transmission Transmission belt is on. Yep. Okay. The other belt's in place. Yep. Okay. Let's flip the mower back over and then we got the top end to do. the brake pulley over here which is the tensioning pulley um, that puts the tension on this belt so we've got to kind of wrap it around that and then get it over this thing here and this tensioning pulley this is going to be a tight fit guys I'm telling you right now just to get it all in here look at that <coughs> boom it's all in there the belt's in there everything's good I think we're good to go flip this bad boy back around that on and what this this little guard does that uh, guys it keeps the belt so it doesn't come off that pulley when you're not engaged looks fine just do a little quick visual inspection on everything okay everything looks good guys let's uh bring it out and fire it up and uh, run the blades uh, without sucking up the carpet. <laughs> oh my gosh. Those that have been around my channel know what I'm talking about. So there's the old belt right there, guys. You can see that thing hammered, man. Look at that thing. Oh my gosh. Bad. All right, let's fire it up.
Ah, so there you go, guys. That's how you replace the V-belt that drives the uh, blades. And I'm not sure what they call it. I think they call it maybe the brake belt or the blade belt. I don't know. Anyways, it's replaced. And uh, the old time master's still going. Man, I don't know how many more years we're going to get out of this thing. She's getting pretty old. Worn out, bald tires, but she still runs good. And I'm going to give her an oil change today as well. So we will catch you later. Bye.